because I slept over it all and I'm like, forgiveness is not an option. TV. Hey y'all, hey guys, welcome to Vani Goes TV. So guys, I wanted to talk about, you know, something that I feel might resonate with a lot of people. Um, as you guys might have seen the title already, okay? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Princess Banigo. To all my returnees, you're welcome. If any, thank you so much. So guys, today I have what I want to talk about. And I hope you guys will just kindly listen to me as I talk about all of this. I'm sorry I'm looking down on my phone because I sort of have it written down here. Um, and I'm talking forgiveness. Forgiveness, should it even be an option? Should, you know, forgiveness be an option at all, like in situations, in things that happen? Should they even consider forgiving, you know, like, I'm just wondering, you guys, what do you think? Because I slept over it all, and I'm like, forgiveness is not an option. Yes, forgiveness is not an option, because, I mean, like, why are we even forgiving? Why? Why should you even forgive anybody? Like, I've thought about it. Why should you forgive me when you can just hold a grudge for so long and just, you know, be pumped and hot and hard forever about it? Anyway, let's just get into this video. Sit back, relax. Come with me on this discussion, on this conversation, so you understand every aspect on why we're having this conversation. So, yes. guys, yes. Um, so, I, you know, I'm someone who usually would be big on forgiveness that is my person i'm someone who would consider forgiveness i'm someone who would consider letting go forgiving so that there will be peace but sometimes peace forgiveness accepting apologies letting go shouldn't be an option mm. and i'm sure you're wondering why 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 should a person even want to hold on to things like this well because there are some things that some people do and you're like okay I want to let go but when you think again when you reflect you like you try and think back again you're like no i cannot forgive this person for this thing i will never forgive this person for this thing yes have you been in that kind of situation before where you know you want to just forgive the whole thing but you're just like never never it's not even an option like there's no need there's no need this apologies forgiveness let's even just not let it happen have you been in that situation please let me know in the comment section right so now i made a video yesterday and in that video it was about a man right a man who his elder brother poured acid on him if you've not seen that video feel free to check right under this video that you're seeing right now this man poured acid on his younger brother due to one or two challenges that they've been going through and one of the things that made me think about talking about this you know, it's because of a comment I got from that video. Yes, I got a comment. And we're going to go into the comment in a bit. But imagine, you know, your elder brother, born from the same womb, pardon me there, the same mother, the same father, decides that, you know, he has had it here because of the issues you guys have been having back and forth, this and that, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> As somebody on this street would say, and then decides that what his deem was for him to lock your door outside. Lock the door so you can't come outside. I don't know how that happened anyway. But locked the door. And then through the net where he knows your bed is at. Because obviously he comes into your home. He has studied everything he knows. And then he doses you, your partner, with acid. Now people have said I should come with the full video. But I want you guys to understand that I don't have right... To the full video so i have to be very careful not to just bring everything that is somebody else's on here so if i find the full video i'm going to put it and if they complain that i should take it down i will okay but i'm going to look for the remainder of that video because it's not complete right somebody left a comment that i should bring the complete part which i'll try and bring the complete part but back to the the back to the discussion so somebody now left a comment under the video that she would forgive now i'm going to that comment right now i'm going to my channel to bring that comment out you know 
she said that she would forgive and i'm wondering forgive exactly why why do you know what this person did this person literally poured acid on you and your family she says i will try and put you on the screen if i can in time i will forgive him but forever he should stay away from me and i'm thinking is this how nice is this how kind or how forgiving some people can be like somebody pours you acid you are disfigured i'm putting this man's face for you guys to see the extent that this man was born this man at the point said he felt like like unalive in himself because like what was he living for like what was he living for so this man was like what am i living for what exactly but somebody was telling me that she's gonna forgive and that just got me you know that comment alone for me yesterday saying that comment was just everything because if you are willing in time to forgive a brother who doused you in acid then why shouldn't you be able to forgive things that are not even as much as acid point because i think that is the highest thing that anybody can do to ruin anybody's life to disfigure you like that is the highest point someone can go to but some people in our lives or that are not even our lives people we don't even know have not even poured us acid they've not gotten to that point you know and we are not ready to let go or forgive them because we feel like oh what you've done to me is the height but if somebody is willing to forgive somebody will pour them acid why can't you forgive accept apology let go of the heart for things that are not as crucial of that and you know it is okay to forgive to accept these apologies and you would stay away from the brother this man can forgive his brother and just stay away forever like just do you i'm gonna do me come up by the as you as we say let's not meet so it just got me thinking I, I had a lot of reflection seeing this comment and i i thought no this is something i needed to talk about now i am someone with a big heart and i'm always ready to forgive but when i saw this man case i was like no no way in hell am i going to forgive a brother or a sister or whatever who, like let me go when i'm 150 years let me go and meet my maker and tell him baba you forgive me but that person i can't forgive that person you know i was ready but when i saw that comment comment it just got me thinking in another perspective another angle like oh so yeah really you know you can just forgive forgiving sometimes it's not even because of the person is for you for your peace of mind sometimes so that you just let go and like whatever so you, you are just free like well whatever you did is on you you know and that is how most of us we've offended people and you know and sometimes they forgive us sometimes they issue out apologies and we act like we're so strong headed that we can't let go now it's, a, it's another thing to forgive and let the individuals in and then they come and hurt you again if you if you're going to forgive just forgive if i'm this brother and i'm forgiving i'm going to forgive and keep that brother at arm's length i'm not never going to dine with that kind of brother so in essence even though i said initially that forgiveness is not, is not an option i think forgiveness can still be an option in certain cases it just depends on how big you are and how time can help you to heal those wounds and I truly hope that we can all forgive, forgive each other. If, I'm a, if I've wronged you, forgive me. If you've wronged me, I forgive you, you know. And I truly hope that, you know, we can all forgive and just, I know it's, it's in, in a crazy world like this, it will be hard to live in peace with everybody, but you can just forgive and, and let go, you know, at the end of the day, because what is in this life really like? People sleep every day and they don't wake up. So when you look at it again, if you can forgive somebody that's poured your acid, why can't you forgive somebody who hasn't even done up to that? And I know there are some people that are watching me that, that just cannot forgive me for whatever reason. They just hate me because it's Bani go, forgive me and let us stay apart. 
you know i'm even talking to the viewers also right now those that might watch this video and watch till this part that you don't just like my face forgive me hmm i forgive you too for not liking me <laughs> Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you watched up to this point, I really wanted to just talk about this because it touched me when Eile Favored left this comment yesterday. And I was like, wow, like this is another aspect, another angle that I never thought of. And I think it's what you have been talked about. So I deemed it fit to look beautiful for you guys, even though I didn't draw my brows. Because <laughs> I've, I've not worn makeup in over three weeks. Like I've just been trying to help my skin or whatever me and this skin shine I know some of you are tired already but whatever it is what it is okay so thank you everyone for watching i love you all and i will see you guys in my next video remember to forgive